Here's a 2000 watt kettle. Uh, this is a two and a half kilowatt inverter, amp meter. That's the 280 amp cell that we put in a King's Adventure King's battery box and in there is a 200 amp BMS. So this is just to Turn test the BMS. Okay. So right now zero amps, Turn it on. As you can see, it peaks up to three, drops down to one point something amps or so. 30.4 volts on the battery, fully charged, 230 uh, on the AC side. One point amps, now turning on. Instantly 206 amps. 2000 watt kettle. So if you work it out, 2000 watts or you go 12 volts, 12.2 volts times 203 amps. Um, that should give you the wattage. Uh, and right now, she's boiling. And the BMS, let's see, uh, it's still cold. Version of 2000 watt kettle uh, running through an inverter is actually 2.4, 2400 watts. So there's another extra 400 watts that you need to take into account. And as you can see, she's coming to a rolling, rolling boil. Voltage is, you know, coming to the peak of the boil. And the BMS board, it's um, just starting to get warm. Nothing uh, toasty at all. Just starting to have a bit of heat onto it. Uh, so as you can see, we are pulling over 200 amps. Uh, to say our amps BMS board. boards are rated at a certain amperage. That's not a peak, that's not a burst, that is constant all day or night. Um, and this is rated at 200 amps. But you Water can see it's boiling. And it's still at 201 amps. 11.8, 12.1, so it's fluctuating, and that's the AC side. Um, and yeah, 200, holding steady over 200 yeah, it's amps. Board, um, it's getting getting warm, um, but not burning hot. It's, it's getting warm. I can still put the back of my hands on it. And so, as far as the uh, capability, thermal, uh, thermally, it's uh, intact and sound. That's coming up towards the end of the boil. Oh, it's fogging up. Uh, and uh, there we go. Did you hear the click? It's turned off, and the voltage back up at 13 point, oops, 13 point. Here's the battery voltage at resting after half an hour. This is after boiling the kettle four times in a row. Uh, it is 13.5, so 13.4 I think we started at, but 13.5, so lithium iron phosphate. So this is the 280 amp hour cells in a DIY uh, battery box.